today we discussed the concepts of random variable and their probability distribution. What is a random variable? A random variable is a variable whose value is specified by the outcomes of random experiment. It can be discrete or continuous depends on the numerical value it's assumed. Random variable must assume numerical values. So we can define the random variable as a numerical uh, description of the outcome of a, a, a statistical experiment. Or it may be defined as a function that assign a numerical value to each symbol even in assembled space. What is a discrete random variable? بيقولي ان discrete random variable ده هو في الاصل variable that assume countable values يبقى variable that assume countable variables random variable that assume countable ايه values يبقى اي متغير عشوائي بياخد قيم قابلة للعد هي دي اللي بنسميها discrete random variable in other words the consequent values of discrete random variable the, consec uh, the consequent uh, variable uh, of a discrete random variable are separated by a specific a gap يبقى لو انا عندي مجموعة من ال values uh, بينها وبين بعض specific gap دي اللي بنسميها discrete random variable a discrete random variable may assume either a finite number of values or an countable infinite sequence of value such as 0, 1, 2 and so on. Uh, for example of discrete random variable involved the number of difficult item in a production line, the number of telephone call received in a given period of time, the number of customers served by a bank, the number of customers served by a hotel, the number of customers served uh, by a cafe or restaurant or any particular day or any particular day. What is a continuous random variable? What is a continuous random variable? بنقول إن ال continuous random variable uh, that may assume many أو uh, any numerical value in an interval or collection of intervals بيقول لي ان الكونتينوس راندم فاريبل هو في الاصل راندم فاريبل بس بياخد قيم within interval بياخد قيم ما بين او بداخل فترات ال experimental outcome based on measurement scale such as زي زي ال time زي ال weight زي ال distance زي temperature زي ال price كل دي بتاخد قيم within interval كل دي بتاخد قيم within ايه interval طب علشان ان شاء الله نطبق الكلام ده exercise number 2 page number 190 classify each of the following as a discrete or continuous random variable classify each of the following as a discrete or continuous random variable number a the time spent by a doctor for examining a patient the time spent by a doctor for examining a patient that any time of any time the within interval any time within interval within interval يبقى عندي بالنسبة لي continuous random variable يبقى أي time continuous random variable على طول من غير أفكر ومن غير ما أقرأ أي حاجة يبقى اي تايم ما بين ايه فترة يبقى هو within interval يبقى هو continuous random variable number b the number of pairs coating on uh, or coat on short uh, number of number of يبقى countable number of يبقى في عندي gap number of يبقى discrete random variable the number of ducks in pond the number of ducks in pond Number of برضو يبقى discrete random variable. The price 
of your suit the price of your suit اي اسعار اتفقنا دي تعتبر ايه continuous random variable لان الاسعار قيم كتير جدا ممكن نحطها within ايه interval Exercise number C, page number 119. Verify whether or not each of the following table represent a valid probability distribution. Uh, the first case, or the case number A, or the table number A, x, 1, 2, and 3. P of x, 0 0.28, 0 0.32, 0 0.5. Firstly, the probability distribution uh, of uh, a discrete random variable processes the following two characteristics number e for each value of x b of x greater than or equal 0 less than or equal 1 if the first condition or the first characteristic for each value of x b of x greater than or equal 0 less than or equal 1 the second condition for the second characteristic, the sum of px of all x equal 1, exactly 1, exactly 1. If we have two conditions, the first for each value of x, b of x greater than or equal 0, less than or equal 1. The second condition, the sum of px of all x must be equal to one the sum of bx of all x must be equal one uh, in this conditions uh, the first case or the case number a x one two and three p of x 0 0.28 0 0.32 0 0.50 0 0.50 i'm sorry the first condition in the uh, is satisfied the first condition is satisfied because each v of x listed in table is uh, in a range between 0 and 1 but the second condition is not satisfied because the sum of all v of x equal 0.28 plus 0.32 plus 0.50 the result will be equal 1.1 so it's not equal one so it's not equal one consequently this table doesn't represent a valid probability distribution this table doesn't uh, represent a valid probability distribution uh, the second case or the case number p or the table number p x uh, equal 5 6 and 7 p of x negative 0 0.2 0 0.4 0 0.8 the second condition are satisfied because the sum of b uh, of p of x equal negative 0 0.2 plus 0.4 plus 0.8 the result will be equal 1 exactly 1 but uh, the first case uh, are not satisfied are not satisfied because uh, the first probability negative 0.2 negative 0.2 less than 0 less than zero uh, so uh, it's not in the range between zero one so it's not uh, the range between zero one 
this table doesn't represent a valid probability distribution this table doesn't represent a valid probability distribution the third case or the case number c or the table number c x uh, equal 3 4 and 5 b of x 0 0.28 0 0.22 0.50 respectively uh, the two condition are satisfied the two condition are satisfied because each of bx in, in the range between 0 1 0 uh, to uh, from 0 up to 1 and the sum of all probabilities represent uh, or the sum of all probabilities equal 1 uh, 0 0.28 plus 0 0.22 plus 0 0.50 the result will be equal 1 exactly 1 so this table represents a valid probability distribution uh, this table represents a valid probability distribution yep. Exercise 4, page number 120. The following table gives the probability uh, distribution of a discrete random variable. x equal 0, 1, 2, and 3. p of x equal 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4, and 0 0.1 respectively. Calculate the following probabilities. Number a b of x equal 1 number b b of x greater than 1 number c b of x less than or equal 1 number d b of x greater than or equal 1 number e b of x between 0 uh, or, and 3 x greater than 0 less than 3 uh, uh, solution by hand uh, the firstly b of x uh, equal 1 the probability that x equal 1 the probability that x equal 1 uh, from uh, the last table uh, the probability that x equal 1 is equal to 0 0.3 is equal to 0 0.3 uh, number p p of x greater than 1 p of x greater than 1 x greater than 1 equal b of 2 2 greater than 1 and p of 3 x equal 3 greater than 1 uh, uh, thus uh, p of 2 plus p of 3 equal 0 0.4 plus 0 0.1 the result equal 0 0.5 0 0.5 number c b of x less than or equal 1 p of x less than or equal 1 less than or equal يبقى في الحالة دي انا معايا p of 1 و less than 1 يبقى p of 0 p of 0 plus p of 1 p of 0 plus p of 1 p of 0 is equal to 0 0.2 p of 1 is equal to 0 0.3 so 0 0.2 plus 0 0.3 the result will be equal 0 0.5 number d p of x greater than or equal to greater than or equal x equal to greater than x equal 3 p of 2 plus p of 3 p of 2 uh, the probability of x equal 2 is equal to 0 0.4 p of 3 the probability that x equal 3 is equal to 0 0.1 0 0.4 plus 0 0.1 the result equal 0 0.5 uh, the probability number e the probability number e uh, p of x 
greater than zero less than three greater than zero is an x not equal zero x not equal zero but greater but greater يبقى عندي في الحالة دي greater than zero one and two but not three so x less than three but not less than or equal b of one plus b of two the probability that x equal one is 0.3 the probability is that uh, x equal two is equal 0.4 0.3 plus 0.4 the result will be equal 0.7 the result will be equal 0.7 Exercise 5, page number 120. Draw a bar chart and define the mean and standard deviation of the following probability distribution. The probability distribution uh, illustrated in this table. Uh, the first row x equal to 3, 4, and 5. The second row represent the p of x corresponding x b of x corresponding x 0 0.25 0 0.35 0 0.17 0 0.23 respectively uh, firstly uh, the expected value of a discrete random variable the expected value or mean of the random variable is a measure of central location for this random variable this formula for computing the expected value of a discrete random variable x is e of x or mu equal summation x multiply p of x both the notation e of x and mu are used to denote the expected value of a random variable this equation the equation uh, equal summation x multiply p of x illustrates the co uh, computational of the expected value of a random variable need to multiply each value of the random variable low x by corresponding the probability uh, here p of x and then add the resulting products and then add the resulting products so uh, the expected value of a random variable x is the weighted average of each occurrence of this uh, values uh, of those values uh, the expected value of x should be uh, interpreted simply as a weighted average of possible values of x uh, so uh, we can compute uh, this example uh, mathematically uh, by this way firstly uh, we can draw a bar chart uh, by hand the bar chart is a graph constructed by bar or rectangular whose height represent the probability uh, and uh, the x-axis represent a labels or uh, the values of x 2 3 4 and 5 uh, the height of uh, rectangular is p of x uh, p of x the first bar is equal to 0.25 p of x li the second bar or the bar uh, labeled uh, 3 is equal to 0.35 uh, and so on uh, secondly we can compute the mean the mean is equal to mu or e of x mu or e of x is equal to summation x multiply p of x summation x multiply p of x you can get them uh, by multiplying the x corresponding p of x and added uh, uh, resulting product and added resulting 
product uh, x p of x uh, is equal uh, the summation x p of x uh, is equal to 3.38 3.38 uh, from this table from this table uh, the standard deviation the standard deviation is the square root of variance is the square root of variance the uh, only as we ex uh, explained before uh, the expected value provides the average value or the weighted uh, average value uh, or the mean uh, for the random variable we sometimes need uh, a measure of a spread or vari variability uh, to summarize uh, the dispersions in the values of a random variable the standard deviation of uh, a discrete random variable denoted by sigma measure the dispersion of the probability distribution يبقى لو عايزين نجيب مقياس للcentral tendency أو للlocation uh, we can perf uh, perform it uh, the mean uh, the measure uh, of the dispersion or uh, the measure of uh, a spread or variability is equal uh, standard deviation and denoted by sigma and denoted by sigma the formula uh, for the variance and the standard deviation of a discrete random variable are the variance is equal to sigma square sigma square equal summation x square multiply b of x minus mu square minus mu square but sigma is the same formula uh, uh, but uh, the square root of this formula the square uh, root of this formula is equal to square root summation x square b of x minus mu square minus mu square uh, you can uh, compute them uh, by uh, uh, squared of all value of x times b of x and added uh, and add uh, the resulting uh, product uh, the firstly one square multiply 0.25 uh, the result equal one the second uh, is three square multiply by 0.32 the result equal 3.15 the third 4 squared multiply 0.17 the result equal 2.72 the fourth 5 squared multiply 0.23 the result equal 5.75 and add them 1 plus 3.15 2.72 uh, 5.75 the result equal 12.62 the result equal 12.62 the square root of 12.62 uh, minus 3.38 square the result equal uh, 1.09 uh, 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 by using calculator the final exercise, exercise number 6, page number 121. The following table listed the number of TV sets uh, C owned by uh, 200 families living at uh, a small city. We have classes 0, 1, 2, 3. We uh, the Medini frequencies 10, uh, 120, uh, 60, and 10. Find number A. 
create a probability distribution for this data. Number B, graph the constructed probability distribution. Number C, find the expected value of the probability distribution. Number D, find the variance and the standard deviation of the probability distribution. Firstly, we can get the probability distribution uh, by calculating the p of x. The p of x equal f divided by summation f. The sum of f is equal to the sample size. It equal to 200 families. 200 families. Uh, we can get the p of zero. p of zero is equal to p of zero is equal to ten divided by two hundred. Ten divided by two hundred. The p of one is equal to one hundred twenty divided by two hundred. The p of uh, 2 the p of 2 is equal to 60 divided by 200 the p of 3 is equal to 10 divided by 200 we can show that uh, the p of x is equal to uh, 0.05 0.60 0.30 0.05 the summation of bx must be equal 1 if the second condition of a of the discrete probability distribution is the second condition of the discrete probability distribution we can draw a bar chart by hand uh, the y axis is represent the b of x and the x axis is represent the uh, classes or x's 0, 1, 2, uh, 3 uh, and the height uh, of this rectangular is represent the uh, probabilities the expected value the expected value will e of x or mu is equal to summation x multiply p of x uh, you can compute the, uh, them by multiplying uh, of each value of x corresponding b of x and add the resulting uh, product and add the resulting product the result is equal to 1.35 we can get them uh, by uh, this table and the variance is equal to uh, sigma square equal x square multiply b of x minus mu square x square multiply b of x uh, the summation of x square multiply b of x is equal to 2.25 uh, plus mu square mu square is equal to 1.35 uh, square uh, the result is equal 0.4275 the standard deviation of them sigma is equal the square root of sigma square the square root of sigma square is equal to 0.6538 uh, أشكر حضراتكم جدا على حسن استماعكم ونتقابل إن شاء الله في الأسبوع القادم مع شابتر 4